friends welcome to my channel watch and how in this video we will be showing you how you can fix microsoft excel cannot open or save any more document because of disk space how you can solve this problem let us get started without any delay so first open an excel file if i am trying to open an excel file which is already uh, created long back if i have many data inside it you can see here it's showing an error microsoft excel cannot open and save or any document because there is not enough available memory or disk space so you can see here it's showing this error so i'll show you in this video i'll show you how you can solve this problem you can see here it's giving you a uh, different kind of option first option is to make the to make more memory available does window work program you are no longer need so and second one is to free disk it's giving some option i am telling you the different process how you can solve this problem so first open an excel file in which you have problem i am clicking ok here then click on file section i am using microsoft excel to 2013 then click option when you will click option though then you will get this kind of window in front of you then click on trust setting and the left side of the corner and then you will get apps of get an option trust customized settings and then click on trusted location and now uh, below side you will get an option add new location so here we will pop up a window like this click on browse section and choose the location where you have saved your excel file as you can see that i have these excel file which is not opening at my desktop so click on desktop and browse that particular file in which you are getting some error this kind of error so this is my user's desktop so i can uh, 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 I'll show you different option how you can go to the current users profile the click the C drive and go to the user and select the, like my user is sysdt sysdt and file location is desktop then click ok and then click ok and don't forget to click on sub folder also and then click ok if you have multiple excel file giving the same error you can follow the same step uh, for the for the each and every files then browse the file location and i uh, click on ok click on desk desktop so here i have to click on desktop and uh, by doing this then by choosing the desktop folder and sub folder folder able to open all the files so i have changed these settings now i'm try let's get let's check it whether uh, my excel file is opening or not so you can see here it's opening now so error has been solved here you can see uh, i can show you by opening another file yes you can see here it's op it's opening so hope this video help you thank you thanks for watching my video thank you